Hey guys, it's David from TheUnlocker.com and today we're going to show you how to get Siri on the iPhone 4. Okay, so before you begin, you must be jailbroken. Don't worry, it's not a scary procedure. Um, it's very easy to do actually and also it's completely reversible. So, head to our iOS how-to section select your device and then find the how to jailbreak procedure for that device with your iOS version. Uh, follow that video all the way until you see Cydia show up on your device. Then you can come back to this procedure and we can continue. Okay, and then once you're jailbroken, uh, you'll have the little Cydia app right here. We're going to open that. Uh, the first time you open it, it's gonna load a few things, etc. It might even restart a couple of times. So that's fine, let it do that. Then once it does, we're going to tap on Manage. We're going to tap on Sources. Then Edit, Add. Okay, then you're going to be prompted with this URL input. We're going to put in Cydia dot iPhone dot fr. and then hit add source. Okay, once that's done, you're gonna see this iPhone tweak source in there now. And you go back to manage, oops, and back to, oops, search. Then we're going to look for spite, S-P-I-T-E. And you'll see spite 3.0.1-1 you're gonna tap that and you're gonna click install. Mine says modify because I already have it installed, but yours right there will say install. Tap that and wait for it to install. And the installing of the Spite program is gonna take about 15 to 20 minutes, so just be really patient. Um, it also helps to connect to Wi-Fi beforehand. Um, once it's done, it'll ask you to click reboot. You're gonna click that. Then it'll boot back up, ask you for a Wi-Fi network, and then it'll give you the option to choose use Siri or don't use Siri. You're gonna choose use Siri and then you'll get back to the home screen right here. Once you do, hit Cydia. And now we're gonna search for another program. Called. Assistant server installer and it's all one word. So you're gonna see, again, I already have it installed just to save time, but you're gonna tap on that. Mine says modify again, because I have it installed already. Yours will say install. You're gonna tap install and wait for that to install as well. Once it's done, hit reboot device again. Once the device reboots this time, now we're gonna go to settings, general, and then Siri, and then turn Siri on and click the back. Oh, then settings, then all the way down to Siri server. And then write down that URL up at the top or you can memorize it, it's not terribly hard. Uh, 127.0.0.0.1 colon 444.4.3. Um, then go back. Then we're gonna click on Spire and we're gonna put that exact URL with the colon and the port number at the end in the proxy host section. Once we do that, back again, click on Siri server again, click start server and then back and then home, hold down the power button Turn off the phone. Once it's completely off, turn it back on. Then once it reboots, you just hold down home to bring up Siri. Enjoy.